Hey guys, Sean T. Phillips here. Welcome to another DVD Blu-ray Tuesday shopping video. There's actually a couple things out today that I want to try and find. The main thing is uh, Day of the Dead, which hopefully, you know, the Day of the Dead Blu-ray, the new one, hopefully Fry's has that one. And um, there's a Jason uh, Bateman film called Disconnect that I want to see if I can find. Uh, I, I think it should be that one should be pretty much everywhere. Heard pretty good things about that. Hopefully I can find it for like the best price for that. Um, so anyway though, let's get going. Well, I'm in the car getting the car washed again. It definitely needed to be cleaned. It had all kinds of dust and squiggles on it. For something different, I'm going to go to Rubio's today. And the second I went in there, they gave me that thing that shakes, you know, that gives you, you know, lets you know when the things are ready. It was shaking since the second like, they gave it to me, and it wouldn't stop. Then I went over there, like, oh, it's not ready. So it's like I had to keep holding the thing for like 10 minutes while I kept shaking and shaking, and they just kept looking at me real weird. So I ended up getting the shrimp burrito there. Yes, like, everywhere I go, like, you know, when it's Mexican food, so I always get the shrimp burritos. But I'm um, going to head over to Fry's now, and hopefully they still have Day of the Dead there, and then they can price match it to Amazon. Into Fry's I go. Come on. Come on. So I got out of fries and they ended up having Disconnect, which was good, um, and Day of the Dead, which was the one that I really wanted to get. This is one of those kind of movies, too, that I watch. I, I probably watch it like two or three times a year. It's definitely like one of my top ten favorite movies, especially like I really think uh, Return of the Living Dead and Day of the Dead are the best, in my opinion, zombie movies that I watch all the time. I love Dawn of the Dead, but for some reason, I just like this one a little bit better. There's something about the whole vibe and the whole underground stuff. just really like that. And I've heard that they're going to be doing a remake, you know, another Day of the Dead remake, you know, a bigger budget one. Hopefully, they, you know, they set it underground, which I did not like that, uh, you know, Mir Safarni one that came out like 2007, Nick Cannon was in it. That was a really bad one. This has got a bunch of new features on it. And they had for $4 each, I didn't even know these were on Blu-ray, um, Flesh Eater, which was kind of a good, kind of cheesy zombie movie, and another zombie movie, which I tried to look it up on Amazon, and I didn't even see the Blu-ray on there. Um, and it's um, Burial, Burial Ground. Yeah, so I don't know. I think I've seen that one before. I know I saw Flesh Eater before. That was a pretty good one. Into Target we go. Glow in the dark. Poop. Little mini teeny tiny weeny peeny Barbie. This movie came out today. I don't know anything about that. If anyone knows this one, let me know. Oh, Beebler poster. Look at these weird things. And these like these are really gross looking, like green cheese balls or something. This is all the Halloween costumes they have out yet. You could basically be Iron Man. Or have an Iron Man hat, or be Wolverine. They had so much stuff out. They have this cool like hand thing here. See, it's like moving hand, like mummy hand. That's pretty cool. And then this thing, like in a bottle, it's like zombie. You should have one of those with me or Wet Movie's face in the bottle, going Blu-rays, 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 DVDs, DVDs. I met this crazy guy in Target with an extreme unibrow, and he was telling me about the trick to a unibrow, and all you have to do is say one phrase, and it's untastic. Ooh, wow! Now I've got a mean unibrow. I'm back at the closing down Blockbuster, but yet still four ninety nine. I was in here like a week ago, and it's like nothing's gone. I think people are all waiting for it to get down cheaper. I'm surprised it's still $4.99. They usually go down like once a week, I thought. So I don't know how low they're gonna gonna get this stuff in here. This is one that I've been wanting, you know, on Amazon used. It's uh, $9.99, like the lowest. So for $5, it's this one that I've been like, for some reason really wanted to watch. Although, I don't know, the case. So we'll squiggle around there. They didn't end up changing the signs yet, but it was four dollars. So four dollars, and you know, he opened it up, and it looked like it was fine. So four dollars, as opposed to ten dollars used. So think about that plus shipping. You know, now three dollars. So it's actually not a bad price for this one. Which a lot of people messaged me when I talked about it before and said it was actually pretty good. Into Walmart we go. And I was actually in here last night at midnight with Dweebo getting, uh, you know, the new Grand Theft Auto with him. It's pretty cool, too. Uh, Danny Tamarelli does a voice. You know, Danny Tamarelli from Pete and Pete does a voice in the game. So that's pretty cool. 
some of the main stuff that came out today was World War Z, and they have like bonus content on the voodoo thing. The bling ring, I didn't like this one that much. And the East, which I talked about, that's a really good one. I have a review of that in the update. This one too, I haven't seen this one. It was on HBO, the Liberace movie. Looks like a pretty good one though. I'm gonna have to probably get that at some point. They have the horror stuff in Walmart now. That's cool. They have grave encounters too. I'm in the beginning of that one. If you guys haven't seen that, like it opens with my review of the first movie. And they have Day of the Dead here, but only on um, DVD. But it's cool they at least carry that. And these sets, The Haunting of Helena, that was a pretty creepy one. This is all the new Halloween stuff. So that's all for this DVD Blu-ray Tuesday shopping video. Like I always say, if you enjoy these shopping videos, give this video a thumbs up. Let me know what you think below of the titles I picked up. And be on the lookout for my new Blu-ray DVD update this coming weekend.